Hey everyone, Angelo here. Welcome to another design tutorial. Today, I wanna to talk to you about Adobe InDesign's latest feature, Subject Aware Text Wrap. Using Adobe Sensei, this tool will help you save time and work more efficiently. So let's get started. All right, so I have a magazine layout here and I've left some space in the bottom portion of this layout to add an image and then use the new subject aware text wrap feature in Adobe InDesign 2021 um, to apply text wrap uh, without having to worry about using Photoshop to maybe cut out an image or even using the clipping path tools in InDesign to do this. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just grab my image and drag it into my layout here. And I set a couple guides in the top and the bottom. And what I'm gonna do is I'm just going to, I'll bring it up for now, snap it to that one guide and snap the top to this guide here. And you can see I've already have the, the text wrap window um, off to the side here. So if you need that, if you don't have that in your dock here, just go to window and then text wrap. That's the easiest and, and best way of getting this window here. So we're all familiar with text wraps and what they do, um, but this new feature will help you save time and help you work more efficiently. And as you know, as designers, that's, that's important. So I'm just going to adjust my image here, maybe bump it up a couple hits, maybe one more, something like this. So I like to, I like to adjust how the image will look even before applying the text wrap. So right now, as you can see, the image is in the front of my layout. I need it to go to the back. So you can adjust it by dragging the layer to the very bottom in the layer panel, or just using the arrange features in InDesign. So right click, arrange, send to back. Another way of doing that is holding shift command and then square bracket. I'm all about shortcuts, so shift command, square bracket. All right, perfect. So I'm gonna zoom in a little bit here and I still have that selected. I still have the image selected. So in my text wrap window here, which I've already torn off the dock, uh, I'm going to apply the wrap around object shape. Now, that doesn't solve our issue in terms of wrapping around this plant that I want. So down below here in the contour options, go ahead and click that. And instead of same as clipping or even detect edges, which you may have tried in the past, the new Adobe InDesign 2021 has select subject, which uses Adobe Sensei or artificial intelligence um, machine learning to pick up the edges much like you would use the selection tool in Photoshop It detects the edges for you now It has handles which you can go in and maneuver if you're not happy with that But because this is a text wrap you can just apply an offset in the offset um, Adjuster here, so just adjust it or increase it and you can see um, it's adjusting increasing around the text and the, the real cool thing about this is this is a regular image. So obviously if you're using something like this where the background is um, not distracting, it's very clean. So it's an easy cutout for Adobe Sensei to detect. Um, if you're using more of a distracting background, um, you may run into some issues of you know this working. So try it out and see which images may or may not work but this is a really cool feature and something that will help you save time and work more efficiently as you're working in adobe indesign so i'd love to know your thoughts leave your comments in the comments section below and just let me know what you think of this new feature so that's how you use the subject aware text wrap feature in adobe indesign 2021 if you enjoyed this tutorial, if you found it helpful, go ahead and hit the like button. Don't forget to subscribe to get notified each and every time a new video has been posted.